Merry Christmas, everyone. Hope you're all having a great one so far. Christmas is in two days, or for Finnish, I think it's tomorrow. F Finland, sorry, I think it's tomorrow. So I hope everyone enjoys their Christmas, has a great one. And if you don't celebrate Christmas, feel free to wish me a happy whatever it is you feel like. Now, welcome to another Dragon 8 Reading Your Answers video. Last week, I asked you what is the worst thing that happened to you this year. Uh, this week, your question is, what is the best thing that happened to you this year. You leave your answers in the comments below and I will read them next week. Can't wait to see what was great about this year for you. So Raddy Star says when I got held up at knife point at work and tied up while these scumbags emptied the contents of my safe and I remember you telling me that and I'm glad you're still okay for the most part from it and uh, hopefully you never have to deal with something like that again. Funny Fluffy says quite a few bad things happened don't really want to share because I'd rather forget it. That's totally all right. A turtle says his grandfather passed away, probably the worst thing that happened. Yep, I remember when my grandma passed away and uh, that was, you know, you can guess. It's always hard dealing with the passing of a loved one. T. Lisa says losing so many wild cats and kittens. And again, same thing, hard dealing with the passing of. Omar says when I had to do my wall surgery. Yes, I remember that. Sophia says nothing really stands out. This was a pretty great year. Well, that is great. No, you'll have to tell me what was best about this year. Now, Moody's Media didn't tell anything. Tell us anything. He said, if I only have one thing to name, that would be nice. I told him he can put a list and I'll read the list, but he didn't put the list. So, oh, well. Mum says, worst thing that happened this year, I guess for me, because I'm a mom, it would be all the BS you got to go through. Uh, me personally would be not being healed of this horrible MS this year. Totally understand that, and uh, yeah, my answer is the same. All the all the BS stuff uh, regarding work. Um, I'm not going to go into details because there's no need for that here. Uh, but yeah, there's that. Phantom Blade says losing the loves of my life. I'll miss Zoe, Chelsea, Melinda, and many more amazing lady friends. May they carry on in uni, and I'm sure they will. And I'm sure you guys may end up connecting, reconnecting at some point in the future. And Mitsu says, okay, now that I've been oh right, her cheeky little. So I'll get to that in a second. Worst thing to me didn't really happen to me, but my grandma was diagnosed with diabetes. And we talked a little bit and I'm glad that she's doing better now than she was before. And as for Mitsu's little cheekiness, she put this thing in here, which is all in uh, um, Finnish, because when I started the last video, I said Moika, which is a uh, hello in Finnish. So now for me to try and read this, Moika Ninko Nate Ta On Venya Nostan Koska Salatit. Noti tan lukemisista. P.S. It's all in the spoken language, so Google might mess it up. Now I have no clue what it means. Uh, <laughs> uh, well, I had no clue what it means. I did put it into Google to see what Google did with it, and it said, Nate, you just, just, um, have fun reading this. <laughs> <laughs> Basically, what it actually means is Moika, huh? Nate, you started this, so have fun trying to read this message. So that was fun. Uh, other languages always intrigue me. It's always kind of fun trying to read them because I know how terrible I am at it. Um, but yeah, either way. That is it for this video. So thank you all so much for watching. Hope you all had enjoyed and hope you're all having a great Christmas. Uh, and had a great Christmas because some of you may not see this until after Christmas. So feel free to let me know what you do get for Christmas as well if you want to share that. And if you're excited about it, I'm sure you will be, hopefully. Uh, this week, your question is, what is the best thing that happened to you this year? I'm going to give my answer now, uh, just so that it doesn't go into uh, next week and blah, blah, blah. And the best thing that happened to me this year is, ironically, oddly enough, uh, losing my job. Um, hmm. So... Uh, before, it was all the BS I had to go through regarding it, and uh, then they fired me two weeks ago. So, yeah. Why is it the best thing, though? Because it means that I'm now free from all the BS and the stress at that place. Anyway, leave me your answers in the comments below. What was the best thing that happened to you this year? And I'll read them next week. Have a wonderful day, wonderful week. Bye-bye and God bless.